Hello, everybody. Obviously, I'm back again um, talking about my my YouTube, which will be called eventually channel will be called Love Equality and Peace, etc. And why did I come to that that title? You know, my apologies. I've not been around, but I've been quite um, poorly, and obviously. I've had, um, and what I usually am, the weather kicks me in the teeth and I've just had my air wash, which has been wonderful. Um, my help has helped me. And I am disabled. I mean, there's my sticks. There you go. Look, see, I use my sticks. Um, and if I don't use my sticks, I'm not coordinated. Um, sometimes with my sticks, I do become uncoordinated. And obviously I've been through the rap. Well, I really have, you know. And um, I'm still doing my work on Photoshop. I'm still getting there. And obviously, when I was, it's really strange, when I did that about why I call about love is more than it is. Everything is more. Everything is more than they're saying. So I've had to change my gloves to get warmer because I do feel the cold um, with what I have wrong with me. And I do. I'm not ashamed of that. And um, it's interesting that um, others just say, oh, love's emotion. No, it's not. And the same with hate. Hate is very close to, to um, love as well. And I should know because I, I was, I was going to really take some really kicking ass, you know. I really was, excuse my language, you know. Um, I wish I did see somebody watching me, but probably didn't like what I was saying. Uh, but I am, I will be having, uh, don't worry, I mean, give me time. I've just come back from the dead. And literally, I have just come back from the dead. And obviously, I'm realising I've had lost 20 years of... Um, um, why are you gone like that? Thank you. I've got a bit of cold. Oh, give me a bell. There you go. I have give being a bit of a suntan now. Uh, instead of pale as a bleeding ghost. Um, and I'm doing a lot of stuff on Photoshop um, to do with NASA and obviously um, ETs, crafts, stuff like that. And obviously I have read these books. And obviously as soon as I saw these books, I thought, aye, aye, it started. And obviously Harp. I read all this. Well, I did nothing but I've always done nothing but read. But obviously, when when you're two and a half years with no help and isolated and been stuck in prison because your your uh, the council, which is the social services, wouldn't help me. So I read a load. I read loads, and also I read the also the forbidden scriptures or the Bible. Everybody should read the Bible. You know, not as a you must do this and you must do that, which it, like it used to be, because I was like that with my grandparents, my my great grandparents, my great great grandparents um, on my mum's side. They were really high, terrible, absolutely so cruel, really cruel. And you shouldn't be like that. You shouldn't be OTT. You know? That's what that young lad did. You see, he's ruined his life. And also ruined others' lives, you know. And you don't do that. I mean, I could have done far more, far, far more with the hate I had coming, well, surviving. But surviving in the bad way, you know. Oh, yes, I could have done. And you can believe me or not. I know what I know. And I always say the truth and nothing but the truth. I don't lie. I won't lie. I can't, I can't lie for Toffee. You ask my mates. And obviously, also, yes, they have. I should know this as a, as a military, military child and a military personnel. And also four generations, probably five generations of military runs in my family, in my ancestry, you know. But that's my webcam, obviously, showing it off. But obviously, yes. And obviously other books. And one of the greatest books that I think that does not show we are very equal is the dictionary. The dictionary does not show 
we are equal. Of course it doesn't. No? And obviously that person's gone off. It might be the internet gone off. Um, do like me if you like what, and, and subscribe to me if you can. I've only just started and I will. I do have many, many stories to tell. Um, but as I said, if you don't, if you don't love and you're full of, um, and your family hasn't given you love, so it's like your parents, you know, they make a big difference in your life. You know, if you have good parents and you know, what gets me is I, I read on here about some wars and stuff and everything, you know, obviously what them and the youngsters were saying, oh, uh, it's the old ones that want war and the youngsters that have to fight it. No, it's not. The ones in power are not, are deranged. They are not, they, they don't, they don't have, oh, they've got all this money and power. And obviously they do crooked stuff like my family. I should know. I've got them in my family, you know. And I'll be talking about these various stuff. It doesn't. Ah, my connection. Ah, I've got to be reconnected. Um, am I reconnected? Yes, I'm back again. I should know, you know, whether they've done that on purpose. I don't know. Um, obviously the internet is cut. Well, yes, because there's weather wars, cyber wars. They're still warring. We just don't see it. It's invisible, but it's not invisible to somebody like me because I feel it because I'm psychic. We are all psychic. We have been told not to use it because it goes back our centuries. Well, yes, because us ladies are more because we used to teach the children. We can heal ourselves. We can heal ourselves with herbal remedies. Not what they say and make a load of money. I mean, you know, look into it quite deeply. And as I said, I'm a vegetarian. I've been a vegetarian since, well, yeah, I was a vegetarian. I went against all tradition. Of course I did. Even in the army, I was a vegetarian. They accepted vegetarianism. But being a cook, I had to cook meat. I didn't mind. I didn't stuff it down your neck. I won't stuff anything down your neck, you know. I'll let you think what you think and figure out and find evidence yourself. And I have got evidence of ETs. Definitely. But I have to um, and also show you that NASA has told a load of lies and so has the Pentagon. Yeah, too, right, they have. As I said, never a straight answer. And they are never a straight answer. Well, you see that men think when they do lie is not to talk about it or just change the subject. Uh, I don't. And I don't let go either, you know. I mean, but there's a good side, my, uh, like my father, that, that man who, obviously the MP that got killed, he might have been my dad, you know. He just wanted to serve as a public, as a public, uh, yeah, MP, member of parliament. He's a backbencher. He couldn't have killed, I mean, that, that chap couldn't have killed a nice man. They're not all the same, you know. We aren't all the same. We're all so bloody different. It's no joke. But geez, what the high bees do, they put us, they get make all our, you know, with all what we've got wrong with us and all what we, well, I was like that. But I was very spiritual. I've always been very spiritual, but my spiritualism went, you know. I hated everybody and I could have done something absolutely worse than that young lad. I could have killed thousands, and I mean it. I could have killed thousands. And I remember when I was on and started getting online, and that's when my my I met my friend, my American friend, who obviously she was in the military as well, bless her. And um, I remember talking to somebody on here, and they were very. They, they couldn't speak to me anymore because I was so full of hate and he was an ex-Hells Angels and he told me it's not the way to be and I'm exactly the same as him now exactly, you know but he had a lady that saved him I've saved myself well yeah, 
I should have died so many times. I should I really have nearly died 30 times. I reckoned it up. I should be here, but I am. Why? Because there's a bigger power than Elon Musk and and and, and Gates and every and and, and 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 the Pentagon and NASA. They all think they are huge and others in China and Russia and everything else, all of them. And they're all male orientated. And I'll tell you something else. Um most men are uh, colorblind, and some are more than others. And I've noticed with male-dominated um, regimes, they're all sober. Rest all sober. And no, no, you need color in life. We are part of color. Our ancestry is part of color. And obviously. I will be divulging evidence that some other things are very, very colourful and not what you expect. Well, one one cardinal, I think, said, actually, ETs will be nothing like us. And there is similarities. But do you think they want war? I mean, if they wanted war with us, no, it's the Pentagon and also the other idiots. And obviously, they, they've been stopped. Well, yeah. They're very, very powerful. And the Pentagon and NASA and other but want to have war with E.T. You, they must be out their head. They, well, they are. We are ruled by not, well, well, no. If you go back in centuries, you can see all the bloody male were not right in it because they had no love, no unconditional love true love and i think that's what helped me through a very very bad time is my mum my mum and dad i mean the boyfriend she had she never loved him and he just used her and he just wanted money and also my evil family they took advantage of her as well my mum my brother took advantage of her they do they do take advantage of you when you are not well I mean, it's like me. I can't believe look at, uh, getting memories back of what I was like uh, 10 years ago, 12 years ago, eight, no, going back 15 years ago before my incident, you know, after my incident. And yet the state never helped me. I was never helped by the NHS. Nobody helped me. So, in 2002, you would have all known about me in the world for something absolutely dreadful. But not my cat now, but obviously my other little cat. Where's she gone? Where are you? No, she's not here. No. She's about Mistra. Mistra. She's obviously, yeah, she's keeping warm, she is. So, and I'll show her. I'll show her to you because I might be on later on. And obviously, because um, I just wanted to tell you that I was so upset about the MP. I really was upset because that could have been me. And I feel sorry. I, I, I blame the wrong mullers. Wrong religion. 2OTT. Using innocence and turning it something what they brainwashing you. Oh, yeah, I know about brainwashing. Too, right, I do. I always tried to brainwash me, but they couldn't. I'm lucky. You know? Um, well, they brainwashed my mum, but they couldn't. Well, not with me about, no. No? And love is unconditional, and it's not just a bloody emotion. And men do think it's just an emotion, and it's not. It's more. Told you. You feel it, you taste it, you hear it, and you see it, and you smell it. That's why when we're grieving, we we smell our relatives who, who's died. We smell our loved one that we die. I smell my mum quite a lot and my dad. He's still here, as far as I'm concerned. There's no wrong with that. And they still talk to me. Not like talking like we are, you know. But you remember, please excuse me, I've got very bad psoriasis. Well, yeah, that's why I don't scratch my face, because obviously my face would all be bloody scratched and bivery. So that's my 
that is my my um how to say my um my army training oh yes martial arts but the one thing our governments don't do is they don't deprogram us we still are the soldier i'm still the soldier i always will be and also i was a military child so I was even more we were little soldiers especially when we lived on camps and i still have it in me but now as i said i can honestly say the pen's in my hand not the sword i mean and that's a good thing because that's what men use the sword too much and obviously another thing like afghanistan why a lot of forces have come out well i'm not surprised they came out they've been delusioned disillusioned it's all right somebody saying oh well we know about that and everything but the thing is you still have a hope that maybe you know it, we are doing it for a good thing you know but not we did obviously the sec first uh, the first world war was not no it wasn't colonialism you know it was you know it was royals getting angry with each other you know families getting it back and it used to be you know now they're using war to make money and all them lives lost and all the lost dreams you know and it wasn't just biden's fault it was put in stream before Biden and before Trump. Because these things take time to come through. I should know by military, how, low, how slow. And obviously the Americans are the same, you know. Well, yeah, if you wait for some, but obviously their promotion system is completely different. They get promoted every year, I think, or every two years, three years. I think it's every three years in the American. But we don't. We, we we have to wait. We have to wait. Somebody kicks the clogs or goes or, or yeah. We earn it. My dad earned his promotion and he got the accolade when he came out of the forces as a commanding officer, even though he wasn't. Well, yeah, I think that's the best thing. You don't need the rank because you don't, when you salute, you don't salute the person. You never do. They all think it's the person. They do also in in American Air Force or American military. It's not. We don't. Not in our UK. We salute the bad. Some of them think it because they get too big -headed. But we've got some bad officers in our, in our, well, of course we have. But they seem to get filtered out. No? It's like uh, there was a commander, um, and obviously he commanded my brother's ship. I can't, don't, I can't, um, I don't really want to talk to, but, but obviously he was um, accused of spying. He left some. Um, you just don't know about cover ups, do you? You know, because I, I, mean, I don't forget nothing. I really don't. Well, I'll tell you, I've got a memory. Everybody says, oh, I'd love to say, no, you bloody well wouldn't because you remember the good and the bloody bad. And obviously when I was, I was full of hatred, I remembered all the bad. I remembered all what I lost and I wanted vengeance. And you don't get vengeance that way. No, you don't. You don't kill. Let's go, go out and kill, stab souls who are doing their job. And obviously also, yeah, it's a dangerous world, but we've always been dangerous. We've always had danger. I've lived with danger. As a false child, we live with danger. But we all live with danger. I mean, we could go down, you know, go, you know, go and get on a bus and the bus could crash and we get killed. Huh? But that's why my uh, I say love. Love is more than, you know, but hate. It's part of that. That's the opposite. And that's where you can become deranged. And you deal you do things that you wouldn't normally do. That probably lad wasn't born a killer. But he was brainwashed into being one. By the wrong side of religion. I don't believe in religion. I believe in spiritual. I am C of E. Obviously Church of England. I always will be a Christian. But. I'm open-minded to anybody else. And I always have been because I've lived abroad. I've lived with it. I've lived with all different religions. And I've seen war fought. And Ireland went to war over religion. 
and they had to do it to protect their own own people. And that was Cyprus. And I'll, I'll never, I'll never forget that because we got caught up in it. I mean, you know, imagine you're hated that much because you're brainwashed. Well, yeah. The Archbishop Macarius shouldn't have done what they did. He shouldn't have exit brought Exioka in. I think he knew that as soon as he put, oh, oh, shit, I've done something. Too late then. Just like Harp. Yeah. Harp. Right. I'm going to say something about this, about Harp, okay? I remember in the 90s, right, before I know about this, right, okay, I remembered, because I didn't know, because they kept it all, well, yeah, they did keep it all quiet. And also I was busy working. I owe you lot. My work and my career came first. I was going to university. I was doing this. I was doing that. And I'm too busy. Obviously, I'm not too busy now. And when this first came about, and obviously I looked through the dates and everything, the day they started using this bugger was when um, there was two holes in the ozone layer. One in the Arctic, one in the Antarctic. Now, you can't blame the Americans because also the Russians and the Chinese still had that. Obviously, they all spied on each other and got each other's secrets. And they do that from a remote viewing. And that is using our psychic abilities and from ordinary military folk. Ordinary military who's in the military. And it's part of their duties to do stuff that really probably they have no choice because you'd have no choice when you are, you know. Um, like my dad did. My dad did not like AI coming. When he saw computers coming into engines, he said, it's not good. It's not good coming into a war machine. And it's not. And obviously this tells me a lot. I thought there was something not right in before the holes in the ozone. And they all blamed us on the uh, on 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 the sprays. No, it wasn't. It was an accident. It was an experiment that went wrong. They both did it. Who did it? I don't know. But they made them holes because this kind of technology can make holes in the ozone layer because obviously it says in here and it's a very good book, better than the angels one because he really goes into great detail and it's Tesla's old ideas. Yeah. They even think the um, Siberian Nazca, uh, obviously in the Siberian, uh, I can't remember the name, but obviously the, the, the forest going all down, that might have been an experiment that Tesla might have done. Who's no? Or it could have been uh, uh, an, an extraterrestrial craft that fell in there. Or it could have just been a, uh, a meteor burst and obviously it burst like what happened with... Um, but how do you not know that what happened in Russia and also Russia recently was an experiment that gone wrong? Because they experimented with things that they shouldn't be using. And because they have no love of life, they will carry on using them until a weapon. And obviously, it's not good. No, this ain't good technology. No, it's not. I don't like this technology. It should be given for electricity, you know. And I remember because I was a Greenpeace and I was friends of the earth and I've always been like that. And now the melting of the ice and the Antarctic, well, I think it was done on purpose. But that's my idea. And obviously also this. They're trying to sort it out, trying to deactivate it. You know, uh, they want to activate it and obviously they want to lessen it. And that's what you call weather wars. The army, all the militaries have always wanted the weather as a, as a weapon. I should know this because I am part of that military as well. So I read that fantastic book and obviously um, Jerry E. Smith, brilliant, absolutely. And I've just come back to this is when I started reading again because I hadn't read for 20 odd years. And so I started reading and I started getting stuff like this again. And some of my old books I found, which my brother left and other git faces who hadn't nicked that weren't signed. Because this is my, my family know that I used to go to... Um, 
new authors that brought out new books in on this subject, you know, of obviously uh, because I, the first book I read in the 70s was Eric Van Danken and also others like them kind of books, you know. Of course, I was interested. My dad was re also read them with me. Um, my mum, no. My brother, <laughs> I, but uh, he did take my books. So he was interested, but he didn't want to tell his sister. You know, he didn't want to tell his sister that she was more knowledgeable than him, because I was more knowledgeable than him. And oh, I got my father. Um, my dad was known, well, he was, he was a genius. But he got the accolade, obviously. And he, he, but he, he didn't want, he didn't want that fuss, and you don't when you like. Well, oh, Tesla didn't really want that, you know. But they used him. That they do use. I mean, Elon Musk and all this lot—they're not genius. Gates isn't a genius. They're just taken other people's knowledge, used their. Oh well, yeah, that's what they try to do with me. But I, in the end, I shut up and I thought, no, you're not having it. No, no. And I will tell you the truth because I'm not in for anything. I'm just in it to tell you the truth and nothing but the truth. It's about time. I mean, I could die. Well, I think I could die, couldn't we? But, you know, I want to get this out. I want to show you also what I found. And I, I have it. But, as I said, you have to forgive me because I have problems with my physical body and obviously PTSD. My PTSD is easing. Because of the memory recall, I'm dealing with it. Well, that's why I know scientists have got it wrong completely about our bodies and our senses. They think our eyes and our ears are like, oh, what a load of bollocks. I should know. Because the thing that I can deal with is the sight of um, things I saw and also the, the hearing. I can deal with that, but it's the smells and the taste. And you ask any soldier, taste and smells is the worst for us because it's our strongest senses because we're psychic. And we have a third eye. Of course we do, our penal gland. But it used to be bigger than that because we did have three eyes. Don't say we're, uh, no, excuse me. We aren't what we are. And also, history is all wrong as well. well. I never believed in history. I believed in archaeology. Well, men wrote it all. You know? And it wasn't equal. Not equal between female, uh, males and ladies. I won't call myself a female because I don't like the male on the end, thank you. No, I don't. I don't like being called a woman. I like being called a lady. That's no, different having a bloody man on the end. I don't know this man. Why should we have that? That's not equal. Why can't you be called man -woms? Why can't you be called man -woms if we have to be called women? You tell me that. Anyway, right. I'm going to get off, and obviously I might do one later on. I need a bit of a rest because I've had a heavy day. Well, as I said, me and my assistant, bless her heart, she's a good girl. She's like my sister. She's more of a sister. You know? And... I've got psoriasis bad on my hands, if you excuse me. Um, and obviously, I've had to cream. When I'm bad, it's on my hands or it's everywhere. Ears. Oh, you don't want it. Eyes. Well, yeah. My eyesight ain't gone. It's just the bloody psoriasis that's in my eyes and all the crap that comes out. You know? Thank God I've had my hair. Oh. And obviously, as I said, I feel the cold. In fibromyalgia, I feel the cold or you feel the heat. I don't really rather think uh, uh, what I'd rather uh, what I'd rather have. I don't know. And you don't want fibromyalgia. You don't want ME. You don't want asthma. You don't want what I've got. And you know, also the other psoriasis and all the other shit I've got. And why the hell should you be living? Why can't you just, you know, and depopulate the world? Excuse me. I have a lot more uses. I have knowledge here. Knowledge. And knowledge is power. And you need it because a lot of you youngsters do will not survive what I could. Even in my state, I would. Because I go beyond, as forces do. We don't feel the pain. My pain barrier is, is I could take a lot of pain. 
God, can I take a lot of pain? Bloody hell, can I? And also I go into a deep meditation to take my pain away and also to take to take myself out from the world. Because I feel the pain. I feel, I, feel you know, I don't have to watch the bloody news to know there was something going on. That's why it's funny that I had, on that day, I brought out what love is about and why you really should love all. You don't have to, but I tell you what, you become a very peaceful peaceful um, being because of it. Because I have. I'd rather harm myself. My dad was the same. We all had PTSD. The whole family. And uh, including my grandparents. And maybe my great-great-grandparents on my father's side. And anybody who's had real... Um, I've had, I've had, uh, I had a trauma too much and obviously become mute. Well, yeah, it's like when the tornado hit, I couldn't speak for months. I couldn't speak for years. No, I couldn't. I couldn't speak for years. So, no. And also, music. Music is very good for PTSD. But some of the music, which is the violent music, can set you off. Oh, yeah. And also, if you're very sensitive, like, oh, I was, I was very sensitive. I always have been. And as I said, I drowned when I was three years old. I died. But it was nothing of this world that saved me. That's all I'll say. And you can think what you did well think, because my dad knew, my mum knew, but she wouldn't know. She was too scared. So we lied about, told you. We lied about, well, yeah, we lied about a, um, um, a naval chap coming back to the launch for his cigarettes. That won't happen. He won't swim for pretty two or three miles out, out to sea because that's how far we we're out, four or three miles, something like that. Because we had to dock far out because the Admiral had his launch on Camino. And that's the only way to get on the island of Camino. And I'm not talking about now. I'm talking about the bloody 60s. And that might have been before Kennedy got shot. I'm not quite sure. Can't remember when Kennedy got shot. 62, 63? Was it back his brother? I know one of the Kennedys, and I remember it very, very. Um, my mum was quite shocked because we, we, we were in, in Malta. Oh, and I was somewhere because obviously I've lived all over the damn place, you know. Well, yeah, you could say I'm a gypsy, but we're a sort of. Not wealthy gypsies, but a bit more, you know, we had a bit more penny, obviously, because my dad's work was that, you know. And I don't like what I'm seeing. I don't like what I'm hearing about the youngsters, thinking that they know everything. They don't know everything. Even I don't suggest I know everything, but a lot of damn, damn sight more because I've experienced hell. Told you, still looking back. But. And you all got to try and believe in something more than money and consumerism. Because it's consumerism that's destroyed. But they're not talking about the filthy rich, are they? We've always called them the filthy rich. Filthy, not all of them, but a lot of them. Filthy principles, filthy habits. Fil well, yeah, I used to work for them. Very wealthy millionaires. And official done. And I didn't like some of them. No, and I just used to say to the agency, I don't want to work for these anymore because pff, you must be joking. I have my ethics and principles, thank you. No? And no, I won't go to bed with any bosses. You must be joking. Told you. This body is a temple. It houses a precious soul. And I would not. No. Nope. After what happened to me as a child, no. Nope. And, you know... I cannot believe how many times women have been treated so violently, you know. Hello, whoever you are. Very nice to meet you, whoever you are. And, yes, I am truthful. And I do have evidence that you cannot say no to. I'm still dealing with it, but I'll be, dealing, I'll be showing you my story to it, you know. Right. I'm going to get off. I promise I'll talk to you soon. No doubt. I said, my, I won't be Leslie and Warren. I will be 
love, equality, peace. Once I start getting my stuff on, and obviously then you'll see. But I'm talking about, as I said, what my channel will be about and why I come to this conclusion of love, equality, peace in the universe, etc. Whatever you want to call it. Dimensions, take that all into account as well. Because we're all finding out the truth because of the unusual things. Well, because we're such a smaller world, because the Internet is a good thing, but it can be used for something else. And we do not want it to be used for dystopia. Thank you. And another thing I'm going to do as well, eventually, is I'm going to grow my own vegetables. It's very easy to do instead of because I don't trust. I mean, the crap vegetables that we've been getting. And obviously, you can bring them in the house if the thing well, is not so bloody good, you know. And obviously, the time now is to grow your win winter vegetables, like kale, potatoes, obviously, some form. They don't believe that, do they? You know, we used to have potatoes, not just in the spring, you know. But then again, they used to save the potatoes and obviously used to eat the seed potatoes. Because, you know, I used to, I'm laughing at some people actually absolutely saying stupid things on here, saying, oh, oh, we won't have any seeds. We can't get any seeds. Uh, excuse me, you make your own bleeding seeds. And I've come from a farming community. Told you, my granddad, I've come from all sorts. Well, yeah, that side was the military. Well, also my granddad was in the military, but also eventually when he came out from the Second World War, he went, he, he, he did farming. He probably had enough of bloody seeing bad things and saying my granddad. He was in all three forces, so he was a unique man. Well, he was in the Army, the Navy and the Air Force. Them skills, you're going to be used for stuff that is not told a lot. And he wasn't, he couldn't say a lot what, what he did. I know he was in Malta, uh, but he was in Malta after the war and he was in Italy after the war, well after the war, actually. Um, and obviously, I hope you like this video. As I said, um, I've got loads of stories. And as I said, I will have evidence and you can see that I'm forces. And I will be showing other things. But, yes, please read these. I recommend these books and you'll understand the damn chemtrails and why we are getting strange weather phenomenon and also why volcanoes are doing their strange thing. Although the Grand Canary Rand, uh, obviously, um, has been like it before. I remember Grand Canary uh, um, um, erupting. I remember Sicily erupting. I remember Mount Etna and also Vesuvius as well, only puffing a bit, but obviously Etna in Sicily is a very similar volcano to what they've got in Gran Canaria. And obviously they last for ages, and they did. It's a very slow process, not like Vesuvius. Vesuvius is a different volcano. Oh, yeah, you're not going to have the same thing. It's sort of different earthquakes. You know, you have deep or high, and the more obviously the deep is, I don't think you get so much, but I think the, the shallower it is, the more damage you get, especially under the sea. Shit. Well, yeah, because that's why we do not want that landslide happening. We're in shit street. All of us in shit street. Well, yeah, of course. But don't forget these books. I, I tell you what, I have a vast library of all sorts of books like this. And obviously, I'm catching up because I had 20 years of being dead. Dead in mind, okay? Obviously, internet is not doing too well, so that's probably why you're hitting up. And please like me. If not, don't worry about it. I'll, I won't stop. I'm not stopping. If you don't like me, I don't care. I will still do my videos. And eventually, I will have my evidence of what work I've been doing on NASA's photographs, on my photo Photoshop, and also... Um, um, not just the moon, not just Mars. Um, there'll be other planets that I see all the same phenomenon happening each time. And I now found out why. And it's because men are colorblind. 
and we're not. And obviously, I dare go against everything. So that's me. I always have done. I've done, well, yeah, I've been a rebel with a cause. But I won't hurt, and I never hurt anybody. Only when I, when I was really bad. Hate is not the way. Please do not hate. Do not hate. No violence. If you want to make your point, write it. Talk about it. But do not wreck statues or things like that. That's not the way. It's not about black matters. All life matters on this earth. There's more life than us on this earth. And there's more life in the universe because only an arrogant git man would think that. And that's, and that's what they are. They don't want us to know the real truth. And I know the real truth. We all know the real truth in the bleeding military. We're just told to shut up. And as a, a children as well, we were told because we didn't want to get dad into trouble. No. Because I love me dad. My brother, I don't know. Don't really care about him anymore. As I said, he's a lost soul. And some are lost souls. Even these leaders, some lost souls. They haven't had love. I've noticed Boris has changed a bit because he's got a, he's got a child. You know? Or maybe maybe he did have another child. I don't know. Obviously, there was something going on that he had another child. I really don't know if that was the truth or not. I don't mean, I don't mean, you know, um, maybe. There's always something that always... Either the mother wouldn't let him have... Well, yeah, I know that. I know that from others. That the reason why uh, that he wouldn't, uh, they wouldn't let the father have something to do with the children. You know, women have used children against men. And that's so wrong for the child. Huh? I had two loving parents. I'm a lucky soul because I want to come back and I would have done something really tragic. Tragic for the poor, so many, many souls I would have killed. And tragic, I would never come back. And I've never been able to tell you what I... Oh, yeah, because something far, far powerful than me and far powerful than all, all these idiots who think they want dystopia and they think they can control us all. Because they won't be able to control us all. Not if you've got knowledge and you don't rely on them, the consumerism. You don't rely on Bill Gates and his land. You don't rely on anybody else. And you stick up for your, your culture and who you are and what you are, what your ancestors are, were, or still are. They always will be. You're part of your ancestors. And I have a belief that I um, the things that our family have shared together have that spirit of love, you know? Not hate, emotion. No, it's not emotion. No, it's probably far, far deeper, far, far deeper. Love is a power and it, it can, we can have equal society because of it if we truly, truly loved all. And I do, didn't. I did before, but I didn't when I went through my terror. Uh, yeah, it made it worse because I was I, I was neglected, so I got worse and worse. I was offered this and I was offered that, all the help I could, and then it was all just totally gone. And that's why I was vulnerable to others. Happens. But I don't hate them. Why should I hate them? Hate is such a bad word. It, it, it's war. It's part of war. Violence, hate, jealousy, and wanting more power can obliterate everything that we love. We don't want that. And it's not about us anymore. It's about something more than us. It's more about the universe. Oh, yeah. I've known this for a long, 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 long time. Right. I'm getting off. Goodbye. Take care. And God bless. And whatever. Many blessings. Whatever. Whatever you are. And love. Peace.
love, equality, peace in the universe, etc., etc. Okay. I pray for that. I really do. Because I've seen too much violence and too much hatred and too much, and yet I've come back from it. But I don't, as I said, I don't hate anymore. I don't want violence anymore. And I understand what that hell's angel is, ex hell's angel is telling me. Again, not a good, no, it's not. All male version. No. Some of them might be okay. I'm not putting you all in the same boat. But enough is enough. You shouldn't hack. Well, yeah, no, I mean, you know, they're terrible things in the top, in, 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 for the sake of religion. Horrible things, awful things. I read about it when I was young. I mean, just because I read a book and they had, you know, a lovely Tudor lady sitting in it, didn't mean it was all the gorgeous bloody book because she was in all her regalia. They all thought that, my family. They didn't really, they, you don't judge a book by its cover. Never do. As I said, I'm a writer. I have written. I will write again, but at the moment I've got to do this. And also, as I said, I've been doing something of artistic because I do believe that. I worked on Photoshop for a long, long time, but I lost everything. I lost my mind. I lost everything. I lost my memory. I lost me. I lost all, everything. But I've come back. It's a miracle I've come back. But catatonic, you don't come back from catatonic on your own. I had no help. Not the right medication either. I'm on it now. Thank God I was diagnosed with PTSD. Only this year. After having it all my life. And it's very hard to get diagnosed like that now. Very hard. I made these myself, so I'll probably make some more. I think they need clean and a bit grotty. They were not nicer colour than this. Anyway, right. Take care. Bye-bye. And be safe, okay? And I'll talk more about what I should have done because I get off tangent. Take care. I can't help it. If you'd gone through what I'd gone through and have a fractured memory, you would sound the same as myself. You might not come back. Determination and the love because I had love, real unconditional love from my parents. And it's a power. It's a real power. And it's not just an emotion. No, because I've seen it. I saw it with my parents. I saw it with my mum and dad. I'm so glad. And I see it in others as well. And they really, truly love. And it's unconditional. You don't put conditions on it. Uh, my... My sister, well, my brother's wife, she put conditions, and obviously, one sided is love, but then again, it's not. Love can also, uh, love, you can't have a love and hate relationship. It's not, no, no. As I said, it's very difficult when one has to make a decision to say that this is not good enough for me. And it's dangerous for me and it's dangerous for you. Oh, yeah. I mean, I've seen it. I saw it on the estate. Parents trying to kill each other and all sorts. In fact, uh, an omen, uh, the father, one of the fathers, obviously crossed the road from me, uh, killed his newborn baby. Said it wouldn't stop crying, so he's get, get, kept hitting it. And I couldn't have children. And I would have loved children. I intervened in a nasty way and so I couldn't have children take care be safe but always have hope and faith I always will take care bye mum bye 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 right come on bye 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 bye